You are now entering Crazy Joe's Galaxy. Enjoy the wild ride. You are now entering through the galaxy. Crazy Joe here from Crazy Joe's Galaxy. We have Monday Night Raw, March 21st, 2016, where the big show comes out. Well, we got the Andrea Jack Memorial Battle Royal coming up at WrestleMania 32, which should be pretty interesting. Find uh, from what I understand, it's going to be on the kickoff show, um, and it could be on USA as well, from what I've heard. Uh, I don't know if that's true or not, but anyway, so Big Show's out there. He's talking. He's going to be in it. We uh, Last year, he won it. He wants to be a two-time winner. The uh, show's all cast come out, and I was like, yes, it was awesome. I, uh, you know, actually, I like the Big Show, and I don't. You know, I like him more. I like him uh, and would rather watch him than I would watch the freaking annoying-ass um, League of Nations. But anyways, the social outcasts are awesome. I wish we had the social outcasts going against the New Day for the tag titles and the lame-ass uh, and League of Nations and the Battle Royal. You know, I, I don't understand why they are in a tag title match in a feud for the tag titles when they suck and people don't want to watch them because they suck. Anyways, uh, enough of that. So the social outcasts come out and they talk shit. So the big show, they talk smack, and they end up actually beating him down, and they're beating him down, and then they're beating the crap out of him. He ends up fighting back, but then they end up beating him down some more, and then Kane returns. The big red monster returns in time for WrestleMania 32. Kane is going to be in the Battle Royal, apparently. He ends up taking out all four members of the social outcast. Then the big show hugs Kane, goes up the top rope. Kane grabs him, choke slams him down off the top rope. And Kane uh, rains down the fire from the turnbuckles and whatnot. So it was pretty interesting. It was a lot of fun. I really enjoyed the whole thing with the social outcast. I'm not a big fan of Kane attacking them. But if, uh, as long as Social Outcasts get revenge at WrestleMania 32 when they dump out Kane and they dump out the Big Show out of the Battle Royal, that will be uh, an awesome WrestleMania moment. Uh, you know, I'm not sure who all is going to be in the Battle Royal right now, so I don't know who I want to win it. But right now, with the six people I know who are in it, I want somebody from the Social Outcasts to win it, like Heath Slater or uh, Adam Rose. You know, uh, Curtis Axel, Bo Dallas, all of them would be awesome, but I, I kind of have to say it'd be actually, like, really awesome if Adam Rose won, like, a huge shock, or Heath Slater. Heath Slater would be actually be, like, the coolest one to win, but for, like, a long shot as a shock, I think Curtis Axel, Adam Rose to win it would be wicked awesome and surprising, and a lot of people would be shocked at it, so it would be pretty sweet. You know, so the Battle Royals actually looking to be pretty interesting uh, so far with, so far, I believe, six opponents in it, uh, if, uh, 20 to 30. So it'll be interesting to see who else fills that Battle Royal up. So leave a like the video, leave me a comment, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Thanks for watching.